Hi, today I want to talk to you a little bit about when you're facing an injury, you have a, a disease or you have had trauma, and basically there is sort of an unknown ideology as to why you're hurting. And what I'm trying to address is those situations that you are told, we really don't know what's causing your problem. However, in one situation, we need to do surgery. And if you do surgery, you may have a 50% chance we're going to help you. Other situations where you can't because of the type of disease you have or the type of process that's going on, that you end up having to use drugs to actually treat the symptoms, not the cause. As many of you know, especially patients that are watching right now, there's a lot of frustration that comes with not being able to get better. And we actually have a video, and it's right here, you can click and go see it. But that video is about how debilitating pain can be till you get to the point it's almost suicidal because it's tough to live. Those are bad situations. Again, here's the video. If you want to click on it afterwards or now, you can go watch that. But what we're trying to do is when you have a patient that has been injured or you have a patient that has a disease or an unknown etiology, but you're faced with the chronic symptom of pain, what we're trying to do is make you better as quick as we possibly can, because as quick as we can means you endure less pain. We're trying to help you avoid surgeries. We're definitely trying to keep you from having to use basically mind-altering drugs, which is nothing but dead in our brain so that you don't feel the pain. We want to avoid that situation at all costs. But what we will actually do is when you look into our functional rest restoration program, you will find that if we can take you and start working electrically with you, doing certain types of exercises, we think we may be able to literally stop your pain and help you feel better. One of our major premises is when you apply electricity to the body, no matter what, no matter what waveform you're talking about, no matter what polarity you're talking about, polarity is positive or negative, no matter what, when you introduce an external electrical stimulus, which is electricity comes out where you put the pads, you will always have some form of a chemical change within the body. Now, we are nowhere near understanding, and I always tell people this, if you can find somebody who can tell you when you shoot electricity in your body, that they're going to tell you, well, this is what's happening, this is what's going on. Don't listen to them, including me, because we really don't understand it completely. We definitely don't understand it completely. We understand small aspects. We can take electricity, and we can take bones that aren't growing together. We can make them grow together. We can take bed sores that won't heal. We can make them fill up. We do this through introducing electricity that causes a chemical change. That is what we actually do with chronic pain patients. We will introduce a range of electrical parameters in which we will help you stop your pain. Pain, chronic pain, where nobody knows what it's coming from really, uh, and except for chronic diseases. Chronic pain is very unnatural. That is not a natural signal. The pain signal is intended to protect the body, not debilitate the body. Chronic pain debilitates. That's what we want to get rid of. From the basis of what we've seen since January 2010, and that's when the Infrex was first introduced, and a patient literally could go home and treat prior to the onset of pain or during pain, what we are seeing, we think possibly when the patient can self-treat, when the patient can exercise and self-treat with electricity, the body is probably learning the constant transmission to the brain, all pain is in the brain. No pain is anywhere else in your body. It's always in the brain. An acute, a pain message, a electrochemical signal goes up to the brain. This is the natural way. And it says, something's wrong. I'm burning my skin, something's stuck in me. The brain then interprets that signal. It makes it 
painful, but it immediately sends down, pull your hand away if it's on something hot. That's normal, natural, safe. Chronic pain is the message continuing to come to the brain, but there's no reason. What we're seeing is when the patient can start treating themselves with e stem, with interferential, with infrax, the body appears to be learning, wait a minute, why am I sending this message up there? There's no reason to send the message. There's nothing that can be done. We think the body is adapting to the input of a positive negative charges, and it is learning to modify to stop that message, unless there's a new source that you can identify something that could harm you. That's what we're seeing. Our entire treatment programs are built upon functional restoration. We want you to be able to go out and do the things you're used to doing. We want to restore function to you. And the one thing that steals function is pain. We're addressing it. That's what we're going after. That's what it's about. Thanks for watching the video.